Oh, boy, are you guys going to let me have it in the comments, especially when I tell you that this Tesman Smart Digital Clamp Meter, the TCM300D, has many of the features that each of these clients do not have. Let me explain. So if you're like me, you have a meter in every bag that you go visit customers in. I have a very high-end precision fluke meter that doesn't leave the shop. And then I visit customers with these Klein tool meters. The problem is that one can't do temperature. This is the CL1000. It has very advanced features, like it has an LED right there, but it can't measure temperature. If I need to work on a car and I need to measure the temperature, I need to measure volts and amps, I take my CL700. But it doesn't have some of the features that this one has. So I'm switching back and forth. What I've come to find is that my Tesman right here, which they sent me out to test, has now become my running meter. This is the one I'm taking everywhere at every client visit. At its price point, the TCM300D is feature rich and can be easily replaced. Perfect for DIYers and professionals. For example, the clamp is rated for 600 volts CAT3 and 600 amps. It's what most of us use out there. Then right here, when you look at the display, a very modern display, and it auto calibrates to see what you're doing. If you're doing DC, AC, if you're doing amps, if you're doing ohms, it self calibrates. It's awesome. It has all the features that these don't in a much more modern design, a smaller design, if, if you will, too. When you look at this Klein here, and I turned it on to volts. Now, by the way, Klein, I love Klein, but I'm sorry, Klein, your digital display, it, it, it reads Radio Shack, guys. Come on, it's time. It's time to update that display. I'm going to press and hold there. Look at that. I get my LED. That's great, but this comes with an LED and it is at a much more affordable price point. I've been testing these three meters against each other and the Tesman has been right on par with all of them. It has not missed a beat. The measurement on voltages and amps and even ohms has not been off when compared by any of these. I would highly consider this one, guys. I'm going to put a link right there since they sent it to me, and you can buy it right there. Just goes to show that sometimes a cheaper tool can do the job even better. I'll be back with a long-term review for you all.